New this morning, illnesses that cause fever, rashes on your face, even body aches are on the rise in southwest Virginia. That's according to the Department of Health. 10 News reporter Keisha Lynn working for you on what's going around and how to stay healthy. Those sound like scary symptoms. Oh, yes, yes, they are, Jenna. And the Virginia Department of Health, it says that it's seeing an increase um, in COVID-19 in our area and throughout the state. In fact, they say that they've seen a trend since June, especially in places like nursing homes. From its latest data, it reported a little more than 4% of emergency vi department visits in our area end with a COVID diagnosis. Par parvovirus is also on the rise, especially in kids. Symptoms include fever and body aches for about two to five days, and a child will also get a rash on their face. I'm told it's extremely contagious. The Department of Health is also monitoring tick and mosquito-borne illnesses, which they typically see an increase of during the summer. The most important thing is to dress appropriately if you're gonna be in an area that you're at risk for tick bites. Do tick checks after you come in for the day and um, use DEET or another, another preventative medication. Epidemiologists with the health department, they say to check your pets too. So far this year, they've seen 259 cases of Lyme disease. Gastrointestinal illnesses are also a problem right now because more people are grilling. Some symptoms include fever and bloody diarrhea. And for all of these illnesses, she says, see a doctor if your symptoms won't go away. Most importantly, doctors urge you to wash your hands and cover your cough. Keisha Lynn, 10 News, working for you.